it's Marie from Travel Camp RV. I'm doing this walkthrough video on our 2004 Gulfstream Mako. Um, as you can see, 28 foot fiberglass trailer. Um, we'll come around here. Got your power tongue jack, <clears throat> two 30 pound LP tanks, your house battery here. Um, front pass through storage. Um, got your awning, scare light, you have dual entry, that entry is for the bedroom, um, and we'll go in through the living. Tires on this side. Bigger bay window. Ladder up there so you can walk on the roof. Spare tire as well. <clears throat> Come through here. I got the slide in. We'll be taking the slide out once I go in the camper. Um, your campsite, your park cable hookups, satellite cable hookups, and your 30 amp service plug. <clears throat> you got your other two tires on this side. Another storage compartment. It did have a slide cover, but that awning has dissipated. <clears throat> Other side of your pass through. And then we'll go inside. <clears throat> Alright, here's the inside. Um, I'm about to take this slide out for you. The button is right here. It's actually a very smooth slide. It's just about all the way out. And your slide's good to go. So as you can see, a lot more living space. I'll step back here. Um, your bigger bay window, recliner chair. All right, here's your kitchen. All the burners on the stove work. You got a vent fan, a, a light for it as well microwave, double basin sink, lots of cabinetry, your fridge, dual feature fridge. Alright, here's that soft spot I was talking about. As you can see, the floor is warped here. Um, this can easily be fixed. You can take up this flooring, take up the existing 5 8 tongue and groove plywood, put down new and then the flooring of your choice. <clears throat> Obviously it needs a good bath. We will give it a good bath. And then if you look in here, there's your toilet, sink, mirror. I just got a bigger shower, which also needs a bath. 
for this bigger shower. And then, and then here, your bedroom. Um, probably needs a new mattress. Overhead cabinets. Wardrobes. Um, there was a little bit of water damage here, as you can see. Um, but I do not believe it is leaking now. But there is some pre-existing water damage. And then if you come around here, I'll show you the floor. And then the other entry. So, as you can see, you can see the floor boat in there again. So, not the worst, but it needs some work.